guys, so this is going to be a very off-the-cuff video. We just had 239 launch, so we're going to try to find a Manta. Because we definitely are not in shape to get a Dire Bear right now. And the Manta's a bit more interesting to me. Let's be honest, the Dire Bear has been done. What do we have? Sabertooths, Dire Wolves, uh, and now we have Dire Bears and... Looks to me like they're basically the same idea for all of them. So what we're going to try to do is dead is find a Manta Ray. Now you can tell how off the cuff we are because we are definitely on the garden boat. It's all I had. We took out the garden raft and we're going to try to find a Manta Ray on it. Probably could have taken the other one, but this is what was near me, so this is what we grabbed. So I'm going to hunt down and see if I can find one of these mantas. Ooh, what is this? This looks like something. Anything down here? Nope, nope, just some fish. But we're going to try to find these mantas and then I will catch up with you once we do. Alright guys, so we changed our plans. Uh, the raft is kind of stupid. I don't know why we took it, but uh, now we're flying the Pteranodon, and this is the first time I've really flown this one. We just tamed it up, and then I had to go to immediately after. So we're going to fly him over the ocean, see if we can't find a Manta Ray. And this thing tamed up with really good stamina. I just checked it. It's at 510. So I think that's going to be pretty cool. This is going to be a good pteranodon for us as long as I don't get it killed right here all right we have some ichthys more coel and I haven't changed the spawn rates or anything on the server I didn't want to do that I wanted to find them the natural way because I think that's a bit cooler nope but it says they like rivers so we're gonna we're gonna try that route out let's see nice little beach here let's reduce some stamina and, um, once again, once I find one, I'll get back to you guys. Alright, guys, so I looked around, and I didn't find a Manta. I didn't see anything out there, and I think they're gonna be more deep-sea creatures. Which kind of confuses me, because I went ahead and bought the Ingram for the saddle. Let's see what that takes. Manta saddle. It takes a lot of metal. Which we don't have right now, but we're gonna head over to get... But it looks like it's a pretty low-level saddle. Let's see here. Ingram points to apply. Let's see if we can find it. Maybe it is higher level. I don't know. What does it look like? Yeah, we can't see the level yet. Yeah, I don't know. But it's only 16 Ingram points. So that's not too expensive. Let's see what levels are around there. Yeah, so that's around Smithy area, Titan. I mean, that's really not too expensive. So I don't know. I guess we'll just head out and check. So, um, we're either gonna find a Manta or get some metal. I'm not sure which one yet. So we're going to head out to the deep ocean, see what we can find. If we don't see a manta, we're just going to do a metal run here. Alright, so we looked for a manta, didn't find anything, so... We're just going to get these river rocks here, get some metal out of it. We also got attacked by a shark looking for a manta, and it scared the hell out of me. Just looking around underwater, spyglass, and all of a sudden this battle music starts. I get launched into the air. I'm damn near peeing myself. Looks like we're getting good metal here, though. There's plenty around here, so that's not a problem. We took out the big raft. Might as well, right? That's what it's here for. So we're just going to keep collecting metal. Make some metal stuff, because it's my biggest weakness right now. Hey, Trike, what are you doing down there? So, I guess that's it for the night. We're going to keep collecting metal. If we find one later, I'll let you guys know. 
Alright guys, so we were out getting some metal. We happened to find this guy. It's a level 76 Megalodon. Just in a really easy spot to take him down. Just kind of too easy pickings to pass up. There's nothing. No, there's another Mega in here. Let's make sure we got the right one first of all. This one's level 116. That'd be awesome. We might need more arrows though. Yeah, and it's so stuck in here, it can't even. It's not even fighting back. I can sit on land and shoot it. I can shoot it from inside my base if I want. Yeah, so it looks like it's just stuck here. Oh, there he is. Better get on. That's a tough one. Are they hitting the raft? I think we might lose Cheryl. That's the wrong one. Which if we do, let's grab these out first. Yep, there goes Cheryl. Oh man, what happened to our frames? This is starting to get on my nerves here. I don't know if we're hitting or not. Let's get closer. We're going to, have to make more arrows too. Okay, well this is odd. Is it down? Yep. So we gotta try to kill this guy now. Just try to drive this away. Stuck on a rock. Let's try to get all that prime meat. That should be plenty of food. Okay, so we are about ready to get the Megalodon up. Just a few more minutes. We got plenty of prime meat on her. Oh, 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 one more is all it's gonna take. So, one more. But, um, while we're waiting for that, we got a little bit of a lag corner here. Uh, I'm gonna show you a few more things. So, while we were taming this, uh, we went out on Terry to get some prime meat and got all sorts of hide in the process. And we also got metal today, and I figured out we can make flak, and that's going to cost about 50 metal, so I figured we'll just go for it. So let's get those all queued up here. And yeah, we have more metal. Don't worry. Plenty of metal cooking in here, and it's really not a bad drive, and we got quite a bit of metal. Came home with a shark. So we came out for a manta. Came back with a shark. Still haven't seen a manta. I think they're in the deep ocean. I did a little bit of reading on them. It said they require angler gel to tame, so we're nowhere near able to do that. Probably not till scuba deer. So we're gonna we're gonna leave the manta for now. I'm definitely happy with this shark though. And we have our pteranodon here, who's turned out to be pretty good. 
got all this meat on him because he was wrecking things. We went through, we were in the swamp, we fought some snakes to get some prime meat, and it's doing really, really well. We have uh, 240 melee damage, and I haven't pumped that at all. All I've pumped is health. So his stamina is great, his melee damage is great. I think I'm going to run around 1200 health and 1000 stamina. And this will be a solid burn. Or we could do movement speed also, but right now movement speed is not super important to us because I'd love to have a movement speed bird, but this is our all around use guy. He's got to kill some things for us because all we have for, we don't have any raptors or carnos or T-Rexes yet. Um, but I think a Spino might be in our future. That sounds like a fun little thing. So, we're gonna finish up this metal here. Let's check the shark out. It should be getting there. Let's see. Oh, yep, just about ready. And this one is female, so we got a name for it. Megalodonna. All right, so um, get back up on the raft here. Whistle follow, and that's gonna do it for our episode today, guys. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe if you enjoyed the video. And if you want to play on our server, go ahead and send me a message. We're definitely looking to take in more YouTubers right now. We'd love to. Oh, uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. 36. Let's see how Megalodonna takes it. 172 versus a 36. It doesn't have a chance. It still makes me nervous swimming out to sea like that, though. Any other ones around? Oh, he's bloody. He's bloody. Alright, get him. Megalodonna. It seemed out at 172. I didn't even check that earlier. Uh, let's check tamed stats real quick, too. Oh my gosh. So almost 4k health, almost 300% melee damage. Holy crap. We didn't get any more weight, but that's fine. We don't need it. Let's get that melee damage up to 300, and we're going to get 4k health. And I don't even know what we're going to do from there. This thing is going to be a beast. So yeah, um, our best dino right now is an underwater dino, but we can make the saddle. So we're going to concentrate on that on our next episode. And that's going to be it for me, guys. Oh, yep, we can wave on here. So we will see you guys next time.